that's where it gets tricky <laughs> is when ancient Egypt and ancient Babylon and this podcast are all happening at exactly the same moment in time. And that's where who is... knows what these are. Damn. That's where I don't know if it's aliens or if it's Us. reincarnation stuff. Yeah. So that also gets in the – that's one of my conflicts too is because I used to believe in reincarnation. But then I, I started do. having my own interdimensional – it doesn't make sense though. Because if you're you in the fifth dimension or whatever dimension – I'm saying fifth because that's the studying that For I've energy. Done. So you could be in ten hundred spots at once because all we are is energy inside of a yeah. like meat fucking but capsule. But that's We're separate – in, that's – that separate incarnations of your higher dimensional being. That's not a reincarnation. So reincarnation well, states right, that right, you, die you die and go right. into another life. That's so what, what I meant. That's what I was getting at. Your lives. But see, what if we don't really die and go. reincarnation yeah. is us all of our lives at once because time isn't right. even. This well, is where it's hard that. to wrap well, the then human that's mind not, around well, it. Then that's this where it's not where it re tricky. That's where it's not reincarnation. It's just that's separate right. it, that's incarnations. Exactly, that's, you know, separate projections. Not, yep. I've been exactly. separate that projections. Pretty you much. might be right. Made up thing. You might be right. You only age because you like do like your birthday. Like when you do your birthday, it's actually a chant and it makes you age. I don't know. That's just a theory I've heard. I think that's a little off the wall, but I do believe that. So they have proven. They have proven. Like, not just – so you can find references to this in every holy book ever, busy, ain't that? Bible, all that shit. But they've historically proven as well outside of the holy books that people used to live a lot longer, four, five, well, six, seven hundred years, was totally normal. No, let's not no even but what I'm, what I'm saying books. is oh, – what I'm saying oh, Lord. is all the different Let's religions, holy books, you know what I'm saying, all talk about it. And then it's been historically proven through non-religious texts too. You're right. So That's what people you're used to regularly okay. live okay. to be four, five, six, seven hundred years old, and then all of a they've sudden, got genetic proof in like old, old bones. Like the they've they all they've of got a sudden some weird. Yes. Nobody lives past like one twenty ish. You know what I'm saying? And there's these different ancient texts about why it happened. Some say the gods came down, <laughs> the aliens came in and genetically modified us. All kind of crazy shit. But it's been proven that humans used to live a lot motherfucking longer. And all of a sudden, no one started living that long anymore. You know what I'm so, saying? So, one of the biggest questions I have is who and what, like, why is there so many different kinds of races on the earth and not everyone's not the same race? Well, okay, we all got let me ask you this why are there so many different huh. kind of strains of weed when you exactly. go to buy some well, weed and they're not all the same? Weed? Modified dicks. But that's what I'm uh, getting at. We're all genetically modified. That's the yeah. thing. All these dickheads have, like, all of these guys wanted to save up money, so now everything's screwed up because of all this. I mean, that's the truth. What we well, now you're getting into a whole be... different thing. I'm talking about, like, so what I was talking about with the how humans used to have a longer lifespan, they have figured out, they haven't figured out how to manipulate it. They figured out that there's actually a sequence in our DNA that causes us to age at the rate we do and not be able to live yes, past uh, around 120 years. And that sequence didn't used to be in our DNA. They found old, like you said, 600-year-old bones Damn. before they died. You know what I'm saying? And that was not in the DNA right. sequence of those humans. They were 600 years old when they were alive. Yeah. So, uh, there is some dating, carbon dating, something where there was like a 590-year-old man found. There actually was. Yeah. Carbon That's data awesome. just tells you how long since it died, but it was, yeah, same type of shit. So that all of a sudden just appears in all the humans on Earth's you DNA. Know. You know what I'm saying? And all of a sudden we start rapidly aging where we didn't used to. Evolution. That's the weird shit. That was, why would that be evolution? Well, because something maybe, intervened. Something maybe or our someone intervened. Just knows that our Earth isn't going to survive. Fucking. We get to go eat hell yeah. Six hundred fucking go. thousand years, and maybe you know, I don't fucking know. So, right. if time's relative to gravity or mass, you know, graphs and mass and gravity and shit like that. So, I was fi figuring maybe the size of our planet and the distance away from the sun, and the you know the speed that it rotates, maybe it's gotten closer to the sun. 
and maybe it's spinning slower or spinning faster maybe and that's making us age faster that's not a bad theory they have proven that they have proven that there's like uh fuck what's the word i'm looking for relativity not the theory of relativity. I'm talking about how space and oh, or how time and gravity correlate oh, is what I was talking yeah. about. 